the Armed Services Blood Program recently had a donor recognition ceremony at the Museum of Aviation. They honored 127 Team Robbins members that gave at least a gallon of blood. Since 2005, Robbins Air Force Base has, with unmatched dedication, enthusiasm, and patriotism, helped the Armed Services Blood Program provide life-saving blood products to our troops overseas and our patients here at home. Major Victoria McCarthy, Chief of Blood Services at Fort Gordon, had this to say. So we are here today to thank uh, the Warner Robbins staff that continuously donate uh, very religiously to the program for the Armed Services Blood Program that most, I want to say 80 to 90 percent of it goes overseas uh, into theaters. So we only have a, a little bit that stays behind for our family members and dependents or service members that are in stamp. Today we are excited to recognize some of our gallon and multi-gallon donors. Um, Robbins Air Force Base is home to the highest number of gallon and multi-gallon donors anywhere that the Armed Services Blood Program collects. Um, so this is a big deal and it's an opportunity for us to thank and recognize these donors for, um, for their selfless service. Mr. Daniel Gillis, 78th Air Base Wing Comm Directorate, an 8-gallon donor, gave us a little insight on the why he gives. The good folks from Fort Gordon have come here to recognize those of us who have been donating blood since I believe 2005 and it's a good cause. They show a lot of appreciation for the folks that donate and I think most of us donate because we understand the blood we give goes downrange to the war fighters and me personally this is an opportunity I know at least every 56 days or so that I am directly supporting the war fighter. For Robbins Air Force Base, I'm Paul Wenzel.